The spectacular hit musical Moulin Rouge recently celebrated its 500th show. So to celebrate, we are here at the Ricky at the Dream Midtown to meet up with two of its newest leads. Derek and Ashley, congratulations. I am so excited that you are the new stars of one of my favorite shows on Broadway. Yay. Tell me you are having as much fun on stage as the audience is having watching. We are. Yeah. <laughs> we yeah. are, we are, we are definitely. And also, I he makes me laugh so much on stage, so any of the joy that you see on stage <laughs> is actually real. It's mutual, it's yeah. mutual. Now, were you fans of the movie prior to getting involved with the show? I know you I were definitely a was. Tell me your story, because I was too. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll start mine, because my I have like, this This runs deep yeah. In, uh, yeah. in, my, in my history. So back when I was in college, there was this company, or there is this company still in LA, uh, for the record, and we used to do these different, uh, we actually share this path. We share this path, okay. it's um, really cool. But they used to do these these <clears throat> performances at this bar in Los Feliz, and so I actually played the Christian track when I was in college in this, in this showcase, in this bar when I was like 19. And then when I got married three and a half years ago, my wife and I actually, our first dance was Come Up May. <laughs> So this I mean, is, uh, yeah, I so it's, it's all happening. I also did some shows with For the Record in Vegas, and I actually played Satine in the sure version this of the same. Yeah, so um, it's, it's, it's really cool. It was destiny that we'd eventually yeah, meet to do this together. Yeah, 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 yeah. So Ashley, you yeah. were standby in the beginning mm -hmm. when this all began. To go from that to where you are now and to always been so heavily involved with this role. What is this feeling like for it to be yours? It's been really wonderful for me to actually be able to step into this and have create my own take with new energy. I don't really know that I have words for it, but it's I'm so grateful and I'm just, I'm having the best time. Celebrities are loving the show too. And recently Lizzo covered a show and was saying <laughs> she's a huge fan. And do you know like if it. anyone has from the movie has ever come to see the show? Yes, I know that Nicole Kidman did come. Did you touch her? Did, <laughs> did you did smell her? Does she have a yeah, good sorry. scent? She um, looks like she would smell she, good. She did <laughs> smell good. She's perfect. We're here at the Ricky, which is just walking distance from the theater. So you can come before the show. So food-wise, we have truffle popcorn, incredible, a cheese tray, caviar deviled eggs, and then we have a truffle grilled cheese with apricot dipping sauce. I'm gonna try the luncheon at Manhattan because it's a whiskey-based drink that is a play on peanut butter and jelly. And I'm gonna pick the the custom Moulin Rouge themed drink, which is Liqueur Rouge, which is a play on a Gibson. And it has this bleeding heart. It has a bleeding I know, it's so cool heart. watching it happen it has a before bleeding. our eyes. And I'm gonna take the summer melody with a tequila gin base. Well, thank you guys for being here, and I just wanted to let you know how wonderful life is now you're in the world and in this show. Oh, oh come on, God. it's show fun. <laughs> Live for a show yes, fun. Yes, cheers.